But I would say that we're absolutely ready. Um, we've got staff, we've got PPE, we've got beds, we've got medications. That's not an issue. South Florida hospitals say they're prepared for any possible increase tied to the Omicron variant. And as the variant spreads, the scramble to get tested is well underway tonight. I live very close by, so it's never been this crazy. So I'm still trying to decide whether I should stay in line or not. But if you want to test, get ready to wait. We're learning that more and more COVID-19 cases in South Florida are due to the Omicron variant. And tonight we have team coverage. CBS 4's Peter Dunge spoke with local health leaders about what they're seeing. But first, we start with Jacqueline Quinn. She's at Tropical Park in Southwest Miami-Dade, who's covering the rush to get tested ahead of holiday gatherings and travel. Jacqueline. Ellie, you can see the crazy lines from here. This actually stretches all the way down about a mile and then it loops. It seems all these people coming uh, home from work are now getting in line and it's like this all over the place. The long lines are at Tropical Park in Miami, CB Smith in Pembroke Pines over in Broward, and same for Markham Park in Sunrise. It was challenging because most of the places that I looked at were booked to capacity. With Christmas five days away, it's a priority for some to make sure they're COVID free. Getting a test because one, outside of traveling, I do have a grandma who's 96. And it seems the lines are only getting longer by the hour as demand surges, but at least two places in Hollywood, one of them at the David Park Community Center and the other Boulevard Heights Community Center offer rapid tests with less of a wait. If you make an appointment, you will be served fairly quickly, um, but the appointments are filling up. You have to go on to the curative.com website to be able to set up your appointment. As of now, there are plenty of appointments available before Friday when they'll be closed through Sunday. Without getting in line or booking an appointment, your options are to find an at-home test kit if you can find it. And finding one of these at-home test kits was pretty hard. I'll take you along on my journey today through two counties in the next hour. For now, reporting in Miami, I'm Jacqueline Quinn, CBS 4 News.